Winning Habits, How to Cultivate Behaviors of Successful People. Welcome. In this book, we'll explore the habits and behaviors that distinguish successful individuals from the rest. Our goal is to equip you with practical strategies and actionable steps to integrate these winning habits into your daily routine. By adopting these behaviors, you'll set yourself on a path towards achieving your goals and enhancing your overall well-being. Success is not a matter of luck, but the result of consistent actions and disciplined behaviors. Through the pages of this book, you'll discover the power of small, deliberate habits that can transform your life over time. We'll delve into the psychology of habit formation, providing you with a comprehensive blueprint for building and sustaining positive behaviors. Before we dive in, I want to take a moment to address something important. As we strive to bring you the best content to help you succeed, we rely on your support. Did you know that only 94% of you are not subscribed to the Better Life Library? If you find value in this book and want to receive more life-changing audiobooks and insightful content, please consider subscribing. Your subscription helps us to continue providing valuable resources to our community. Let's embark on this journey to success together. The Invisible Blueprint of Success In the quiet moments of dawn, when the world is still wrapped in the remnants of night, a select few are already up, setting the foundation for a day of triumph. What differentiates these individuals from the rest? It's not just their drive or ambition. It's their habits. These seemingly insignificant routines form the invisible blueprint that guides them to success. To understand the significance of winning habits, we must first recognize the profound impact of our daily behaviors on our overall success. Habits, the invisible architecture of our lives, shape our actions and, consequently, our outcomes. They are the automatic responses we perform without conscious thought, influenced by the cues in our environment. Habits are not just actions. They are powerful forces that mold our identity and define our destiny. This chapter will unravel the foundational principles of building winning habits and illustrate how these behaviors pave the way to success. We will delve into the psychology behind habit formation and provide a step-by-step -step guide to creating and maintaining positive habits. By the end of this chapter, you'll have the tools you need to start crafting your own blueprint for success. Let's embark on this journey by exploring the basic concepts of habit formation and the role of consistency in achieving long-term goals. Understanding these principles is the first step in transforming your life and achieving the success you desire. Understanding habits, the basics. Habits are automatic behaviors triggered by cues in our environment. They form the foundation of our daily routines and can significantly influence our success. Understanding how habits work is the first step towards cultivating winning behaviors. Habits are divided into three parts. The cue, the routine, and the reward. The cue is the trigger that initiates the behavior, the routine is the behavior itself, and the reward is the benefit we gain from the behavior. This loop becomes ingrained in our brain over time, making habits difficult to change without a clear understanding of their components. Consider the habit of checking your phone first thing in the morning. The cue might be waking up, the routine is picking up your phone and scrolling through notifications, and the reward is feeling connected and informed. By recognizing these elements, you can start to understand how your habits form and how to modify them for better outcomes. In essence, habits are the brain's way of conserving energy. By automating frequent actions, our minds free up space for more complex tasks. This automation is beneficial when the habits are positive, but it can be detrimental when the habits are negative. Recognizing this dichotomy is crucial for making intentional changes. Research has shown that nearly half of our daily actions are driven by habits rather than conscious decisions. This statistic underscores the importance of developing positive habits to ensure that our automatic behaviors align with our long-term goals. Developing a new habit involves deliberately choosing actions that support our desired outcomes. This process requires awareness, intention, and consistent effort. By breaking down the habit loop and analyzing each component, we can design new routines that better serve our aspirations. For instance, if your goal is to improve your physical health, you might identify a cue, such as finishing your morning coffee, to trigger a new routine like going for a walk. The reward could be the invigorating feeling of exercise or the satisfaction of starting your day with a healthy activity. By focusing on these elements, you can gradually build a new habit that contributes to your overall well-being. Understanding habits is not just about recognizing their components. It's about appreciating their power and influence over our lives. As we proceed, we will delve deeper into the mechanisms of habit formation and how you can harness this understanding to cultivate winning habits. The Habit Loop Cue Routine Reward The habit loop is a powerful concept in understanding and shaping our behaviors. 
This loop consists of three components, the queue, the routine, and the reward. By manipulating these elements, you can create new, positive habits and alter existing ones to better serve your goals. One, queue. This is the trigger that initiates the behavior. Cues can be anything from a specific time of day, an emotional state, an event, or even a particular location. Identifying your cues is essential for understanding the starting point of your habits. Two, routine. This is the behavior itself. It's the action you take in response to the cue. Routines can range from simple tasks like brushing your teeth to more complex behaviors like managing a project. Understanding your routines helps you see the patterns in your daily actions. Three, reward. This is the benefit you gain from the behavior. Rewards reinforce the habit loop, making it more likely that you will repeat the behavior in the future. Identifying the true reward can sometimes be tricky but is crucial for modifying your habits effectively. For example, let's examine a common habit. Snacking while watching TV. The cue might be sitting down to watch your favorite show. The routine is reaching for a snack, and the reward is the pleasure or comfort you get from eating. To change this habit, you could keep the same cue but replace the routine with a healthier option, like drinking a glass of water or eating a piece of fruit. The reward remains the same, feeling satisfied, but the routine has been altered to support a healthier lifestyle. Another example is incorporating a new habit of reading more books. The cue could be finishing dinner, the routine is reading for 30 minutes, and the reward is the relaxation and enjoyment you get from the book. By consistently following this new habit loop, you can gradually make reading a regular part of your evening routine. Understanding and utilizing the habit loop empowers you to take control of your behaviors. By identifying your cues, routines, and rewards, you can intentionally design habits that align with your goals. This intentionality is a key factor in building winning habits. Experiment with different cues and rewards to see what works best for you. The goal is to create a habit loop that feels natural and rewarding, making it easier to stick with the new behavior over the long term. Over time, these positive habits will become automatic, driving you closer to your success. As we move forward, we'll explore more strategies to help you build and sustain positive habits, ensuring that your daily actions are aligned with your aspirations. Starting small, the power of microhabits. In the quest for success, the journey often begins with small, seemingly insignificant steps. These microhabits, or tiny, manageable actions, can lead to significant changes over time. Starting small helps in overcoming the initial resistance to change, making it easier to integrate new behaviors into your daily routine. Microhabits are designed to be so small that they seem almost trivial. However, their simplicity is their strength. By lowering the barrier to starting, Microhabits make it easier to initiate and maintain new behaviors. For example, if you aim to start exercising regularly, begin with a microhabit like doing just one push-up a day. This small action is easy to accomplish and sets the stage for more substantial habits. The concept of microhabits is rooted in the idea that success breeds success. When you consistently achieve small goals, you build confidence and momentum. This positive reinforcement encourages you to take on larger challenges over time. The cumulative effect of these small wins can lead to profound changes in your behavior and outcomes. One effective strategy for implementing microhabits is to attach them to existing routines. This technique, known as habit stacking, leverages the power of established behaviors to create new habits. For example, if you already brush your teeth every morning, you could stack a new habit of drinking a glass of water immediately afterward. This approach makes it easier to remember and perform the new habit as it becomes linked to an existing routine. Another key aspect of microhabits is their focus on consistency rather than intensity. The goal is to perform the habit daily, no matter how small the action may be. Over time, this consistency helps to ingrain the habit into your routine, making it a natural part of your day. As the habit becomes established, you can gradually increase the intensity or duration of the behavior. Consider the example of developing a reading habit. Instead of setting an ambitious goal of reading for an hour every day, Start with a microhabit of reading just one page each night before bed. This small commitment is easy to keep, and as you become accustomed to the routine, you can gradually increase the amount of reading you do. The power of microhabits lies in their ability to create sustainable change. By focusing on small, manageable actions, you can build a solid foundation for lasting habits that contribute to your overall success. Remember, the journey to greatness is a series of small steps, each building on the last. As we continue, We'll explore the importance of consistency and how the 2190 rule can help you turn these microhabits into lasting behaviors that lead to success.
consistency is key. The 2190 rule. When it comes to building habits, consistency is paramount. The 2190 rule is a popular concept that provides a structured approach to habit formation. According to this rule, it takes approximately 21 days to form a habit and 90 days to create a lifestyle change. This principle highlights the importance of persistence and long-term commitment in habit formation. The first 21 days are critical for establishing a new habit. During this period, the focus is on integrating the new behavior into your daily routine. Consistent repetition helps to ingrain the habit into your subconscious mind, making it easier to perform without conscious effort. This initial phase requires dedication and discipline, as the new behavior may still feel unfamiliar and challenging. To illustrate the 2190 rule, let's consider the habit of journaling. For the first 21 days, commit to writing in your journal every day, even if it's just a few sentences. The key is to maintain consistency and make journaling a regular part of your routine. As you persist, the habit will begin to feel more natural, and you may find yourself looking forward to this daily reflection time. After successfully completing the initial 21 days, the next step is to maintain the habit for a total of 90 days. This extended period helps to solidify the behavior, transforming it into a lasting part of your lifestyle. By the end of the 90 days, the habit should be well established, and you should feel confident in your ability to sustain it over the long term. The 2190 rule emphasizes the importance of patience and perseverance in habit formation. It's essential to recognize that building new habits is a gradual process that requires time and effort. There may be days when you feel tempted to skip the habit or revert to old behaviors. During these moments, remind yourself of the long-term benefits and stay committed to your goal. To support your consistency, consider using tools and strategies such as habit trackers, reminders, and accountability partners. A habit tracker, for instance, allows you to visually monitor your progress, providing a sense of accomplishment as you mark off each day. Setting reminders on your phone or calendar can also help you stay on track especially during the initial stages when the habit is not yet fully ingrained. Accountability partners can play a crucial role in maintaining consistency. Share your goals with a trusted friend, family member, or mentor, and ask them to check in with you regularly. Their support and encouragement can help you stay motivated, especially when facing challenges or setbacks. Consistency is the foundation of successful habit formation. By adhering to the 2190 rule and maintaining regular practice, you can transform new behaviors into enduring habits that support your long-term goals. As we move forward, we'll explore the concept of habit stacking and how it can further enhance your ability to build and sustain positive habits. Habit stacking building on existing behaviors. Habit stacking is an effective technique that involves attaching a new habit to an existing one. This method leverages the stability of established routines to make the adoption of new behaviors easier and more automatic. By linking a new habit to a well-established one, you create a seamless transition that helps integrate the new behavior into your daily routine. The idea behind habit stacking is to use the momentum of an existing habit to trigger the new one. This approach reduces the effort required to remember and initiate the new behavior, making it more likely to stick. For instance, if you have a habit of drinking coffee every morning, you can stack a new habit of reading a book for 10 minutes right after you finish your coffee. This way, the act of drinking coffee becomes the cue for starting your reading session. To successfully implement habit stacking, follow these steps. 1. Identify an anchor habit. Choose an existing habit that is already firmly established in your routine. This anchor habit should be something you do consistently without much effort. Examples include brushing your teeth, eating breakfast, or commuting to work. 2. Select a new habit. Determine the new behavior you want to adopt. Ensure that this new habit is small and manageable, especially in the beginning. The goal is to make the new habit easy to perform so that it doesn't feel overwhelming. 3. Create a clear plan. Develop a specific plan that outlines when and where you will perform the new habit. The more detailed your plan, the better. For example, after I brush my teeth in the morning, I will do 5 minutes of meditation. 4. Monitor your progress. Keep track of your habit stacking efforts. Use a journal or a habit tracker to record your daily progress. Monitoring your activities helps reinforce the new habit and provides a sense of accomplishment. 5. Adjust as needed. Be flexible and willing to adjust your habit stack if necessary. If you find that the new habit is not fitting well with the anchor habit, tweak your approach until you find a combination that works for you. Let's explore an example to illustrate habit stacking in action. Anchor habit. Every evening, you sit down to watch the news after dinner. 
New habit. You want to start a gratitude practice. Habit stack. After I sit down to watch the news, I will write down three things I am grateful for today. By linking the new habit of gratitude journaling to the well-established routine of watching the news, you create a strong association between the two behaviors. Over time, the new habit becomes an automatic part of your evening routine. Habit stacking can be applied to various aspects of your life, from improving productivity to enhancing well-being. The key is to start small and build gradually. As you become comfortable with the initial habit stack, you can expand and add more layers, creating a comprehensive system of positive behaviors. Incorporating habit stacking into your routine provides a structured and efficient way to build new habits. By leveraging the power of existing behaviors, you can accelerate the process of habit formation and ensure that your new habits become a natural part of your daily life. As we proceed, we'll discuss the importance of tracking progress and how journaling can support your habit-building journey. Tracking progress, the role of journaling. Keeping a journal to track your progress helps reinforce your commitment to new habits and provides insight into areas that need improvement. Journaling is a powerful tool that allows you to document your journey, reflect on your experiences, and make necessary adjustments to stay on track. By recording your daily actions and reflections, you create a tangible record of your efforts. This practice not only helps you stay accountable, but also provides a sense of accomplishment as you see your progress over time. Journaling can be particularly effective during the initial stages of habit formation when motivation may waver. To make the most of your journaling practice, consider the following tips. 1. Set clear goals. Begin by outlining your goals and the specific habits you want to develop. Write down why these habits are important to you and how they align with your long-term objectives. Having a clear purpose will keep you motivated and focused. 2. Track daily progress. Dedicate a few minutes each day to record your actions related to the new habit. Note whether you completed the habit, how you felt during the process, and any challenges you encountered. This daily tracking helps reinforce the habit and highlights patterns that may need attention. 3. Reflect on challenges. Use your journal to reflect on any obstacles or setbacks you face. Analyze what caused the difficulty and brainstorm strategies to overcome similar challenges in the future. This reflection helps you develop resilience and adaptability. 4. Celebrate wins. Acknowledge and celebrate your successes, no matter how small. Positive reinforcement boosts your confidence and motivation, making it easier to continue your new habits. Record these wins in your journal to remind yourself of your progress. 5. Review and adjust. Regularly review your journal entries to assess your overall progress. Look for trends and patterns that indicate areas for improvement. Adjust your approach as needed to ensure continued growth and success. Consider the following journaling template to help structure your entries. Date. Record the date to track your daily progress. Habit. Specify the habit you're focusing on. Completion. Note whether you completed the habit for the day. Feelings. Describe how you felt during the process. Challenges. Identify any challenges you faced and potential solutions. Successes. Highlight any successes or positive outcomes. Reflections. Reflect on your overall progress and any adjustments needed. Let's illustrate this with an example of someone trying to build a habit of daily meditation. Date, July 4th, 2024. Habit, meditation. Completion, yes. Feelings, felt calmer and more focused afterward. Challenges, found it difficult to sit still for the full 10 minutes. Successes, successfully completed the session despite restlessness. Reflections. Consider starting with shorter sessions and gradually increasing the time. By maintaining a detailed journal, you create a valuable resource that supports your habit-building journey. The act of writing itself reinforces your commitment and provides a clear record of your growth. Over time, this practice can help you develop a deeper understanding of your behaviors and the factors that contribute to your success. Tracking your progress through journaling not only keeps you accountable, but also provides valuable insights that can enhance your habit-building efforts. As we continue, We'll explore strategies for overcoming obstacles and dealing with setbacks, ensuring that you stay on track towards achieving your goals. Overcoming obstacles. Dealing with setbacks. Setbacks are a natural part of the habit-building process. They can occur due to various reasons such as unexpected life events, loss of motivation, or simply the difficulty of breaking old patterns. Learning strategies to overcome obstacles and stay on track is crucial for maintaining your progress and achieving long-term success. One. Expect and accept setbacks. 
Understanding that setbacks are inevitable can help you maintain a positive attitude when they occur. Accepting setbacks as a part of the journey reduces frustration and allows you to focus on solutions rather than problems. Remember, progress is not always linear and occasional setbacks do not mean failure. 2. Identify triggers. Reflect on what caused the setback. Was it a particular event, emotional state, or environmental factor? Identifying triggers helps you understand the root cause and develop strategies to avoid or manage similar situations in the future. For instance, if stress at work leads you to skip your exercise routine, consider stress management techniques or adjusting your schedule to accommodate your workouts. 3. Develop a plan. Create a specific plan to address setbacks. This plan should include strategies for getting back on track and maintaining your motivation. For example, if you miss a day of your new habit, decide in advance how you will resume the next day without feeling discouraged. Having a clear plan can reduce the impact of setbacks and help you recover quickly. 4. Stay flexible. Be willing to adjust your habits and routines as needed. Life is unpredictable, and flexibility is key to sustaining long-term changes. If a particular approach isn't working, don't be afraid to modify it. Flexibility allows you to adapt to changing circumstances while staying committed to your goals. 5. Seek support. Having a support system can make a significant difference in overcoming obstacles. Share your challenges with friends, family, or an accountability partner. Their encouragement and advice can provide the motivation you need to persevere. Additionally, joining a group or community with similar goals can offer valuable insights and support. 6. Practice self-compassion. Be kind to yourself during setbacks. Negative self-talk and harsh criticism can demotivate you and hinder your progress. Instead, practice self-compassion by acknowledging your efforts and treating yourself with the same kindness you would offer a friend. Recognize that setbacks are learning opportunities and part of the growth process. 7. Focus on the big picture. Keep your long-term goals in mind to maintain perspective. Remind yourself why you started the habit and the benefits you hope to achieve. Focusing on the big picture helps you stay motivated and resilient, even when faced with short-term challenges. 8. Learn from setbacks. Each setback provides valuable lessons that can improve your future efforts. Analyze what went wrong and what you can do differently next time. This reflective approach turns setbacks into stepping stones for success, helping you build stronger habits over time. 9. Celebrate small wins. Acknowledge and celebrate your progress no matter how small. Celebrating small wins reinforces positive behavior and boosts your motivation. It reminds you that every step forward, no matter how minor, is a victory. Consider the example of someone trying to build a habit of daily exercise. If they miss a workout due to a busy day, they might feel discouraged. However, by reflecting on the cause, a hectic schedule, they can adjust their plan to include shorter workouts or find a different time of day to exercise. Seeking support from a friend can provide additional motivation and practicing self-compassion helps them stay positive. Overcoming obstacles and dealing with setbacks is an essential skill in habit formation. By expecting setbacks, developing a plan, and maintaining a flexible, supportive approach, you can navigate challenges and stay on track towards your goals. As we continue, we'll explore the importance of accountability and support systems in building and sustaining new habits. Accountability, the importance of support systems. Having a support system or an accountability partner can significantly increase your chances of success in building new habits. Accountability provides external motivation and encouragement, which can be crucial during the habit formation process. 1. Finding an accountability partner. Share your goals with a trusted friend, family member, or mentor. Choose someone who is supportive, reliable, and willing to check in with you regularly. Their role is to provide encouragement, offer advice, and help you stay on track. The mere act of sharing your goals with someone else increases your commitment and accountability. 2. Regular check-ins. Schedule regular check-ins with your accountability partner. These can be daily, weekly, or at intervals that work best for both of you. During these check-ins, discuss your progress, challenges, and any adjustments needed. This ongoing dialogue helps you stay focused and motivated. 3. Join a group or community. In addition to having an accountability partner, consider joining a group or community with similar goals. These environments offer collective support, shared experiences, and valuable resources. Online forums, social media groups, or local clubs can provide a sense of camaraderie and encouragement. 4. Set clear expectations. 
Clearly define the role and expectations of your accountability partner or group. Specify how often you will communicate what type of feedback you expect and how you will support each other. Clear expectations help ensure that the accountability relationship is effective and beneficial. 5. Use technology, leverage technology to enhance accountability. Apps and online platforms can help you track your progress, set reminders, and connect with accountability partners or groups. Tools like habit tracking apps, shared calendars, and messaging apps make it easier to stay connected and committed. 6. Be honest and open. Honesty is crucial in accountability relationships. Be open about your successes and challenges, and don't be afraid to ask for help when needed. Transparency builds trust and ensures that you receive the support you need to stay on track. 7. Celebrate success together. Share your achievements with your accountability partner or group. Celebrating successes, no matter how small, reinforces positive behavior and boosts motivation. Acknowledging your progress together creates a supportive and encouraging environment. 8. Provide mutual support. Accountability should be a two-way street. Offer support and encouragement to your accountability partner or group members. Providing feedback and celebrating their successes fosters a sense of reciprocity and strengthens the accountability relationship. Consider an example of someone trying to build a habit of healthy eating. They might choose a friend with similar goals as their accountability partner. Together, they could plan weekly check-ins to discuss their meals, share recipes, and encourage each other to stay on track. They might also join an online community focused on healthy living for additional support and resources. The importance of support systems in habit formation cannot be overstated. Accountability provides external motivation, guidance, and encouragement, helping you stay committed to your goals. By finding an accountability partner, joining a supportive community, and leveraging technology, you can significantly enhance your chances of success in building new habits. As we continue, we'll explore the role of positive reinforcement and how rewarding yourself can motivate and reinforce new behaviors, making it easier to sustain your habits over the long term. Rewarding yourself, positive reinforcement. Rewarding yourself for sticking to new habits provides motivation and reinforces positive behavior. Positive reinforcement is a powerful tool in habit formation, as it helps to create a sense of accomplishment and satisfaction, making it more likely that you will continue the behavior. 1. Choose meaningful rewards. Select rewards that are meaningful and motivating to you. The reward should be something you look forward to and value. For example, if you enjoy watching movies, treat yourself to a movie night after a week of consistent habit practice. 2. Immediate versus delayed rewards. While immediate rewards can provide instant gratification, Delayed rewards can enhance your sense of achievement. Find a balance between the two. Immediate rewards could be small treats like a favorite snack, while delayed rewards could be something more substantial, such as a weekend getaway. 3. Match rewards to effort. Ensure that the reward matches the effort and significance of the habit. For smaller daily habits, smaller rewards are appropriate. For more significant milestones, such as completing a month of regular exercise, consider a larger reward that reflects the effort involved. 4. Non-material rewards. Rewards don't always have to be material. Non-material rewards such as taking time for yourself, enjoying a relaxing activity, or spending time with loved ones can be equally fulfilling and motivating. 5. Celebrate progress. Recognize and celebrate your progress regularly. Even small wins deserve acknowledgement. Celebrating progress reinforces the positive feelings associated with the habit, encouraging you to keep going. 6. Create a reward system. Develop a structured reward system to keep track of your achievements and rewards. For example, you could create a point system where each successful day of habit practice earns points that can be redeemed for rewards. This system adds an element of fun and gamification to the process. 7. Mindful rewards. Be mindful of the rewards you choose to ensure they support your overall goals. Avoid rewards that might undermine your progress. For example, if your goal is to adopt a healthier lifestyle, Choose rewards that align with this objective rather than ones that could potentially sabotage it. 8. Visual Reminders Use visual reminders to keep your rewards and progress in sight. Create a vision board or use a chart to track your milestones and rewards. Seeing your progress visually can be highly motivating and keeps your goals at the forefront of your mind. Consider an example of someone trying to build a habit of studying regularly. They might decide to reward themselves with a relaxing bath after each study session. For longer-term milestones, such as completing a month of daily study, they might treat themselves to a new book or a fun outing. 
The key to effective positive reinforcement is consistency and relevance. Ensure that the rewards are given consistently and are relevant to the effort put into building the habit. Over time, the positive associations with the rewards can help to solidify the new habit, making it an integral part of your routine. As we continue, we'll explore the concept of reflection and adjustment, emphasizing the importance of regularly evaluating your habits and making necessary adjustments to ensure continuous improvement and sustained success. Reflect and adjust the continuous improvement cycle. Regularly reflecting on your habits and making necessary adjustments ensures continuous improvement and sustained success. Habit formation is an ongoing process that requires regular evaluation and adaptation. By reflecting on your progress and making adjustments, you can optimize your habits to better align with your goals and circumstances. 1. Schedule regular reflection. Set aside dedicated time each week or month to reflect on your habits. Use this time to review your progress, celebrate your successes, and identify areas that need improvement. Regular reflection helps you stay aware of your habits and their impact on your life. 2. Analyze your habits. During your reflection time, analyze the effectiveness of your habits. Ask yourself questions such as, are these habits helping me achieve my goals? What challenges have I faced? How can I overcome these challenges? This analysis helps you gain insights into what is working and what needs adjustment. 3. Adjust and optimize. Based on your analysis, make necessary adjustments to your habits. This might involve modifying the cue, routine, or reward, changing the timing or frequency of the habit, or trying new strategies to overcome obstacles. The goal is to continuously optimize your habits for better results. 4. Set new goals. As you achieve your initial goals, set new ones to keep yourself motivated and progressing. Setting new goals ensures that you continue to challenge yourself and grow. These goals can be incremental steps that build on your existing habits or entirely new objectives. 5. Seek feedback. Ask for feedback from your accountability partner, mentor, or support group. External perspectives can provide valuable insights and suggestions that you might not have considered. Feedback helps you refine your habits and stay aligned with your long-term goals. 6. Celebrate milestones. Acknowledge and celebrate significant milestones in your habit-building journey. Celebrating milestones reinforces your commitment and provides a sense of accomplishment. It also helps maintain motivation and enthusiasm for your goals. 7. Be patient and persistent. Habit formation is a gradual process that requires patience and persistence. Understand that setbacks and plateaus are normal. Stay committed to your process and remember that continuous improvement is key to long-term success. 8. Document your journey. Keep a detailed record of your habit-building journey including reflections, adjustments, and milestones. This documentation serves as a valuable resource for future reference and inspiration. It also provides a comprehensive overview of your progress and growth. Consider the example of someone working on improving their productivity. During their weekly reflection, they might notice that working on complex tasks in the afternoon leads to decreased efficiency. By adjusting their schedule to tackle challenging tasks in the morning when they are more alert, they optimize their productivity. Seeking feedback from a mentor might reveal additional strategies, such as time blocking, to enhance their workflow. The continuous improvement cycle emphasizes the importance of flexibility and adaptation in habit formation. By regularly reflecting on your habits, making adjustments, and setting new goals, you create a dynamic process that evolves with you. This approach ensures that your habits remain effective and aligned with your changing needs and aspirations. Conclusion. Embrace your journey to success. As we come to the end of winning habits, how to cultivate behaviors of successful people, it's important to remember that the journey towards success is a continuous process. The habits and behaviors you develop today will shape your future and determine the level of success you achieve. Throughout this book, we've explored the foundational principles of habit formation, from understanding the habit loop to leveraging the power of microhabits, consistency, habit stacking, tracking progress, overcoming obstacles, and utilizing support systems and positive reinforcement. Each chapter has provided practical strategies and actionable steps to help you cultivate winning habits and integrate them into your daily routine. Building and maintaining positive habits requires dedication, patience, and perseverance. It's a journey filled with challenges and setbacks, but also with growth and achievements. The key is to stay committed, remain flexible, and continuously reflect and adjust your habits to align with your evolving goals and circumstances. Take the insights and strategies shared in this book and apply them to your daily life. Embrace the power of small, 
consistent actions, and stay committed to your goals. Remember, success is not a destination but a journey. Every step you take, no matter how small, brings you closer to your aspirations. As you move forward, keep in mind the importance of self-compassion and resilience. Be kind to yourself during setbacks and celebrate your progress along the way. Seek support from others and stay connected to a community that shares your goals and values. Thank you for reading this book. We hope it has provided valuable insights and inspiration to help you cultivate winning habits. Don't forget to subscribe to the Better Life Library, like, and comment to support our channel. Your engagement helps us to continue creating content that empowers and uplifts our community. Here's to your success and the winning habits that will get you there.